It began as barely a flicker, almost a whisper in the data, a cold, silent speck moving faster than anything that should exist in that region of space. Observatories from Hawaii to South Africa picked it up first, sending alerts almost simultaneously. Soon after, NASA confirmed what no one expected, an unregistered object, unknown, and most unsettlingly coming from beyond our solar system. At first, it looked like just another wandering rock, drifting through the void. But anomalies appeared almost immediately. Its velocity was astonishing, its path unervingly precise, and its surface reflected light in ways no ordinary asteroid could. When scientists traced its trajectory backward, it became clear that this was no random visitor. It was heading straight for the heart of our solar system. The James Webb Space Telescope turned its gaze toward the object, and what it began to reveal was not just unprecedented. It was something humanity may not be prepared for. If this wasn't simply a visitor, if it was observing us, then our understanding of deep space itself could be about to change forever. Between June 25th and June 29th, the Atlas tracking system locked onto the mysterious interstellar object. It would soon be named 3I Atlas. But unlike the countless icy wanderers cataloged over the years, 3I Atlas defied every expectation. It moved at over 152,000 miles per hour yet followed no known orbital path. Its origin did not lie in the Kuiper belt or near Neptune, but in the remote depths of interstellar space, likely traveling for millennia before reaching our cosmic neighborhood. The timing was the first red flag. Before 2017, humanity had never detected an interstellar object. In the short years since, we've encountered three, and each one has been stranger, faster, and more baffling than the last. Aumuamua in 2017 was elongated, accelerating unpredictably. Borisov in 2019 was faster and volatile. And now, 3i Atlas, brighter, more precise, and far more unsettling. The James Webb began dissecting its light signature, and the data only deepened the mystery. Reflected brightness suggested enormous mass, yet scans indicated it was surprisingly small. Its surface appeared polished, metallic, cold, and highly reflective, possibly hollow. Harvard astrophysicist Avi Loeb, who had speculated that Aumuamua could be artificial, immediately raised the same concern here. Look for non-gravitational acceleration, he urged, because if it's propelling itself, that implies intent. From the start, 3i Atlas resembled a cosmic hybrid, combining the unexplained acceleration of Aumuamua with the inbound trajectory of Borisov, yet fitting neither category. Its motion was deliberate, almost surgical. It didn't tumble chaotically like a natural fragment. It rotated with unnerving symmetry, one side consistently absorbing more heat than the other, as if equipped with a thermal shield. Webb's thermal sensors detected a faint, constant signature, structured, not random. Then came the most unsettling discovery. 3i Atlas was adjusting its course in precise increments without detectable jets of gas, dust, or debris. This wasn't a drifting rock nudged by sunlight. This was something steering itself. Spectral analysis from NASA's Goddard Space Flight Center revealed carbon-based compounds arranged in ways far more consistent with advanced engineering than natural geology. Complex electromagnetic fluctuations hinted at hidden compartments or layered structures beneath its surface. This was no cosmic debris. It was a machine. And if it was a machine, it had a maker. Whispers began circulating among scientists worldwide, not about what it was, but who had sent it and why. Then, abruptly, the flow of information stopped. Agencies that had been sharing updates, including NASA and ESA, suddenly sealed their data. Public databases froze. Observation logs went dark. Independent researchers encountered technical restrictions, and journalists probing the discovery were met with redacted documents and carefully worded statements. This blackout fueled speculation that 3i Atlas was too disruptive to release without careful consideration. In space, silence can be more revealing than any statement. If 3i Atlas was artificial, its existence could challenge politics, global security, and humanity's understanding of its place in the cosmos. For centuries, the night sky had been vast and indifferent. 
Now, in just a few years, it seemed populated with deliberate visitors. Some scientists began noticing patterns. Three interstellar objects in less than a decade, each stranger than the last, was this random? Or was it the deliberate unfolding of a plan? And if so, was 3i Atlas the next phase, or the final one? As James Webb continued its silent vigil, a darker hypothesis emerged. What if 3i Atlas wasn't merely passing through? What if it had been waiting, designed to become detectable only once humanity reached a certain technological threshold? Its arrival seemed too perfect, too precisely timed. For billions of years, the galaxy had been silent. Then, almost immediately after we developed tools capable of observing deep space objects, something appeared, quiet, deliberate, impossibly precise. It didn't feel like a message. It felt like an evaluation. A probe not here to speak, but to observe, maybe even to judge. Webb's high-resolution data revealed patterns that couldn't be dismissed as coincidence. Reflective surfaces varied in ways suggesting adaptive shielding, controlling heat output relative to sunlight, something Earth engineers spent decades perfecting. Its rotation period was almost clockwork, hinting at hidden stabilization systems. Intermittent bursts of narrowband electromagnetic emissions pulsed at irregular intervals. To the untrained eye, it looked like noise. To specialists, it resembled data packets, but where were they being sent? The line between natural and artificial blurred until the evidence tilted heavily toward the latter. Tracking its trajectory backward revealed no alignment with known stars, suggesting it had drifted for tens of thousands of years. Perhaps 3i Atlas was part of a vast network of probes cataloging civilizations, silently observing. If so, it hadn't just found us, it had been waiting for this moment. Inside labs and space agencies, debate raged. Should humanity attempt active communication with lasers or radar, risking unknown consequences? Or remain silent and observe, hoping not to provoke it? Webb continued its quiet monitoring, mapping subtle changes in speed, spin, and thermal output. Then came the anomaly that unsettled even the most cautious minds. Infrared data revealed a repeating heat fluctuation, precise, mathematical, prime number based. Not chaotic. Not random. A possible encoded signal. If deliberate, 3i Atlas wasn't merely observing, it was communicating in a language subtler than radio waves. As 3i Atlas continued its journey into the inner solar system, the truth became undeniable. This was no chance encounter. Whether a probe from an ancient civilization, a relic of technology predating humanity, or something beyond comprehension, it was here. It was deliberate. And it had chosen its moment with unnerving precision. The James Webb Space Telescope, built to peer billions of years into the past, had instead forced humanity to confront the present. For decades, we believed ourselves the explorers. Now, it seemed, we were being observed. And if this was their way of introducing themselves, one question loomed larger than any other. What comes next? Because the most terrifying part may not be that we've been found, it's that this could only be the beginning. And as the light of 3i Atlas cuts across our telescopes, silent and purposeful, we are reminded that the universe may be far stranger, and far less forgiving than we ever dared imagine.